everybody, it is Paris. Today's video is going to be my back to school clothing haul. Some of these items are more summery because it is still warm out for a little bit, but then some of them are more for fall. But they're all clothes that I'm going to be wearing throughout the school season. And as I just said, I am in college, so a lot of these clothes are more for like going out, I suppose, even though I like never go out and I hate it. So not all of these are necessarily like dress code appropriate or like high school, middle school appropriate, but these are all clothes that I will wear as a college student. Everything that I can find links to, I will link down below because I know it's always helpful for you guys. So first off, First off, I'm gonna start with an order that I have from Boohoo. They sent me some really fun pieces for back to school. I will have everything linked down below for you guys. I really like Boohoo because they are inexpensive and trendy and they have clothes for like seriously every single occasion. Like casual clothes, more girly fun clothes. They have going out clothes, they have fancy clothes. I got like a homecoming dress from there one time when I was in high school. The first item that I have from there is kind of spicy. These are like faux leather pants. I've seen these on like some YouTubers and bloggers that I watch. I thought this would be fun for going out. Obviously I wouldn't just like pull up to class in these. They look so tiny like I don't know if you guys can tell how narrow these are they do stretch and they do fit but they're like tight and I know they're leather pants so they're supposed to be tight but like these things are tight I feel like if I ate six grains of rice I wouldn't be able to fit into these anymore so we'll have to see I did size down in these I got these in a four I'm pretty sure and I kind of wish I got them in a six like, sometimes their stuff runs really big sometimes it runs really small so you gotta kind of just read the reviews and sort of judge by the model like what size you want next up i got this bodysuit i also bought this with the intention of wearing it for going out it is a white ribbed um t-shirt style bodysuit i don't need t-shirt style bodysuits i wanted a white one because it was just simple it's gonna go with everything and this will be good for going out it is a little bit see-through so i would probably say size up on this because you don't want it to be like so tight i got this in a four as well and i probably could have sized up to a six that snaps at the bottom and it is a thong style bodysuit which is nice because then you don't have like underwear lines if you're wearing jeans or like a tight skirt next up i got a pair of jeans and i'm kind of bummed about these because these ones are too small on me i got them in a four and i should have gotten them in a six in the winter time i did another haul with boohoo and i got a pair of black ripped jeans really similar to these and i got them in a six and they were way too big so this time i got a four and they're too small so i just can't win i'm gonna have to give these to my sister or something but regardless they are really cute on um, they're just black distressed skinny jeans these are a must you guys if you are going into college or if you are in college and you don't have a pair of black ripped jeans any type of outfit they always look good and so my first boohoo ones didn't fit so i'm really sad that these ones don't fit also but a gain for my sister i guess so next up i got this fun little set Set from Boohoo. It is a sweater and jogger set. This is gonna be great because I dress so lazy all the time to class. It's in this really pretty purple color. I love the color purple, you guys, um, but I don't really have many clothes in that color for some reason. Um, but these are what the pants look like. They're just these knit uh, joggers that cinch at the bottom. A pretty standard jogger shape. The matching top looks like this. It is this like off the shoulder, loose, comfy uh sweatshirt wearing them by themselves too that's what's awesome about sets you can't go wrong with enough loungewear in college so next up i got this t-shirt i just kind of liked it i don't really know why it's kind of this random t-shirt i picked out that has like some random word on it that i didn't even notice if you're new around here um my name is paris and i'm a sucker for everything with my name on it because when i was a kid and you know when you go on vacation and there's all those gift shops with like keychains and water bottles and stickers and like those little license plates and crap that have names on it my name was never on that um i know a lot of you can probably relate as i got older I start finding my name on legit everything because they named a whole city after me. But some people might think it's obnoxious to have your name on your clothes. It's a little bit oversized, which I like, but it's super comfy. So it's going to be really fun for school. I think this might look cute with, dare I say it, biker shorts. And at first I was like, biker shorts are ugly. Those things look so weird. You look like Lance Armstrong. Like that's not cute, but they're kind of growing on me. I hate to say it. Next up from Boohoo, I have another bodysuit. This is a black ribbed long sleeve bodysuit. I don't have any good long sleeve bodysuits and I need one. Still gotta look fire in the winter. So I got a long sleeve one. It's really cute because it has a little notch in the front that you guys will probably see better in the try on. But this is again, a little bit small, probably could have sized up in this. Um, but regardless, I'm still gonna wear it. It's still gonna look cute. Then I got this camo skirt. You guys know, or maybe you don't know if you're new to my channel, but I am a camo fiend. I used to think camo was so ugly. I was like, you look like you're about to go kill a deer for no reason. Camo's been growing on me the last year. I've been a sucker for everything, but I didn't have a camo skirt. Like what? I have every other article of clothing in camo, but not a skirt. Fits me great. I love the colors. It's such a travesty because I accidentally bought it in petite and I'm not that petite. Your girl's like 5'7". I'm not like a giant, but I'm also not petite. So this is so short on me, you guys. Like, I don't know if I want to wear this out because when you're like dropping it low on the dance floor, you'd probably give away the goods and that is not really what I want to have happen. Sadly, I don't know if I'm going to be able to rock this, but I love it. I love it so much. 
got this little top which is so fun and so on trend um it is one of these like off the shoulder little peplum tops with the tie in the front you guys have probably seen these everywhere it's actually a little bit big i got this in a size six this is where my problem is right because like when i buy sixes they're too big but then when i buy fours they're too small and it's just like a little hard to see now because it's all black but this is so freaking adorable it's so on trend this is a good like transitiony piece because you can wear this with jeans going out but then it's still a fun like summer top for when it's warm out this final item i have from boohoo i am obsessed with you guys it is one of these really big oversized v-neck um cardigans i suppose it's not really a sweater because it buttons all the way it has these big brown buttons going all the way down the front and then also has pockets in the front so like hello score 10 points for this sweatshirt i've been seeing sweaters like this and cardigans pretty trendy lately so i picked this up for myself it fits me so well what size did i get this in i got this in a medium probably my favorite item that i got i'm obsessed with it it's also so soft and comfy which that's everything that i got from boohoo everything will be linked down below definitely check it out thank you to boohoo for sending me those items i love everything next i'm going to show you guys some things that i got from brandy melville i actually have two different Brandy Melville's that I went to over the course of this summer um, all across the country. I'm just such a traveler. So I always like to hit up Brandy when I go places that have one, which is not many. So first off, I'm going to show you guys the things that I got from Brandy in Boulder, Colorado. I was there in like the middle of July earlier in the summer. First thing that I got is this Colorado t-shirt. If you know what Brandy is, you probably know what this t-shirt is. It is a classic. I was really on the hunt for this last summer when I was in Boulder. I love the fit of their t-shirts and I wanted one that says Colorado from Colorado, but they didn't have any. And this year they finally brought them back and I saw it in the store and I geeked out because I've been wanting this for so long and the checkout girl was like oh my god I'm so happy they brought these back it was a whole thing I've been wearing this shirt like crazy you guys just the perfect fit and the second and final thing that I got from Brandy in Colorado is I got this little hoodie um it's a white quarter zip hoodie which I really like because I like the style of that um it's double lined super thick and cozy Brandy just has the coziest stuff um and then it has this St. Croix uh, Virgin Islands logo on it with like the sunset and the boats I love this design I really wanted this in a t-shirt but they didn't have any so I I got it in the hoodie so it has that there and then it says Virgin Islands on the sleeve. I just love the style. I've never seen like a little quarter zip hoodie like this from Brandy and I'm really happy because it's also not too cropped because a lot of their hoodies are really cropped on me and I don't know about you guys but when I'm wearing a hoodie I want it to be comfy and big. So now I'm going to show you guys the stuff that I got from Brandy Melville in Seattle. I was just there. The person that I got is probably my favorite you guys. I'm obsessed with this. I found this in the changing room it was like on one of the racks that someone had put back and i didn't see it anywhere in the store and i freaking love it so it's like a collared button sweatshirt which i've never seen before brandy stuff is so cozy it's like fleece lined on the inside so soft and oversized and comfy in this navy color but it's cute because it has buttons and a collar but it's still a sweatshirt so it's comfy and then it says seattle athletics on the little chest part here which i also thought was fun because like i got it in seattle i wore this on the plane i wore it right after i got it i'm obsessed with this and i got these shorts i got these really cute little gray and black plaid shorts they have pockets only girls know how exciting it is for things to have pockets because that is just not standard on our clothes but i legit saw these on one of the mannequins like way up on the top shelf and i got some girl to get it down for me because i'm annoying but hey i bought them i was a paying customer They're really comfy and casual my sister kind of said they look like boxers and i sort of don't disagree but they're obviously not because i like wear them out they're really different i definitely don't have any plaid bottoms like this um they're easy comfy cute all those great words then i got another pair of shorts from brandy in seattle you guys i'm also obsessed with these like honestly i had the best brandy trip with these things they're all kind of basic and comfy but i love all of them so these ones are these like thermal waffle knit shorts they have a little tie in the front and then they cut out a little bit on the sides so they're like this darkish i guess these are black and they have pockets i'd probably wear these to school like wear them to class i don't think they're too much like pajamas some people may disagree but i think that they're adorable i've been wearing them so much final thing from brandy seattle is i got this little tank top it's pretty basic it's just like this gray knit um little button tank top i thought it was a good basic to have because i didn't have any tank tops that were gray um this would look cute with the plaid shorts with the thermal shorts with like literally anything really soft and comfy like everything from brandy is it's definitely basic but it'll match a lot of things so while we're on the topic of things that i bought in seattle i'll show you guys the other thing that i purchased in seattle we went to the patagonia store downtown there and i got a new patagonia i'm really excited about this the better sweater quarter zip i got it in this adorable bright blue color um, I have this in gray and it is my favorite thing ever. I wore it like four times a week in the winter time. I saw this in the blue. It was on sale. They're having like 30% off sale, which was the best deal I've ever seen from Patagonia. I know my gray one I wore all the time. So I know I'm going to wear this one too. I love the fun bright blue color. Um, it's just a nice little quarter zip. These things are so warm, you guys. As I mentioned, I live and go to school in Wisconsin where it 
is absolutely freezing so having warm clothes is a must now i have two pairs of shoes to show for you guys um the first ones are these adorable rainbow ones i wore these on my trip to seattle and oregon and they were actually pretty comfy the bottom's nice and squishy so these are by the brand gola so they are white um little canvas sneakers but then they have rainbow stripes on the side i've been so obsessed with rainbow lately you guys i think i talked about it in my vlog but everything rainbow i've been dying to have i think that they're adorable i bought these off lulu's i originally saw them on free people but they were sold out of them like everywhere i tried dsw i tried so many websites and eventually lulu's came through they had legit one size and it was my size so it was meant to be i'm just obsessed with these they're gonna be so perfect for back to school then the next pair of shoes that i got you guys i'm so excited about this my bank account wasn't super excited about this but i am got a pair of golden goose sneakers and let me just say a little spiel that no one probably cares about but i don't want to get like hate comments or whatever first things foremost i bought these entirely with my own money second thing i did not pay full price for these but i still paid a lot of money for them every youtuber i watch has bought those like dior converse and gucci slides and crap but for me that is a lot of money it's more money than i spent on everything especially a pair of shoes i've been fiending for them for months and months and months i found these on this little like random italian resale website and i just did it I was like, it's a back to school present for me, treat yourself, I want these forever, and I'm so happy about it. So these are the Golden Goose High Star sneaker. I really wanted those because I love platform. They are black with a silver star on the side and then silver on the back. Definitely a treat yourself moment, a little back to school gift to myself, but I'm so in love with these shoes, you guys. I can't wait to wear them for school. I know they're gonna match everything. Next, I have some jewelry pieces to show for you guys. I got sent a couple of chokers from Lucy Caroline Designs, literally like the cutest ever. Um, so she sent me a couple of her chokers and I'm obsessed with them. It came in the cutest like pink packaging and a cute little note and like I'm just obsessed. So I'll have these linked down below and her website. For sure go check them out. The first choker is probably my favorite. It's a black beaded choker with a little gold star on it. I don't have a lot of black chokers. Most of my jewelry is like white or gold or silver. So the black is so fun. Okay, you can't see that at all, but you'll see it in the Tron better. I think this is so cute. She said this is one of her most popular designs and I see why because it's really simple but it's so adorable. And then she sent me this really cute red one it is this red beaded choker since i go to university of wisconsin it's gonna be really cute for game days and all of that stuff and i don't have any red chokers so i'm really excited about this one i love wearing simple little beaded chokers like this and then the third one that she sent me is so adorable and like so on trend it's this white beaded choker with lightning bolts all over it like hello trendy definitely go check out her website and use my coupon code because she has the cutest like affordable trendy jewelry that i know all you guys are gonna love so i'm obsessed with the lightning bolts so next up i have two things from princess polly i got two pairs of shorts not sponsored bought these with my own money um the first pair is these tan linen shorts they're so wrinkly so apologies for that these are definitely more of a summer item but i thought that they were really different and something that i don't have and they're really easy to just throw on i'm going to new mexico in a couple of weeks so these are going to be really really fun for that good for the desert i don't know they're just summer vibes they're comfy they're casual the next thing is i got these shorts these are the famous princess polly like paper bag shorts i actually already have these in a denim color that i love and that i wear all the time i love the fits they're just really flattering and cute and unique so i wanted to get them in white so i've been wearing these a lot since i didn't have a good pair of white shorts they have like a guacamole stain on them so i really need to wash them they come up really high so it's cute with like crop tops and everything i have one random thing from nasty gal i got a pair of jeans i've been wanting a pair of like super super distressed jeans for back to school and for going out and stuff i got these in a size six i believe look at this they're a perfect light blue wash and then they just have a ton of big giant rips and then like a frayed hem at the bottom i love jeans like this my one comment is like all the holes are already totally ripped I connected them are already totally ripped so i just need to cut them off um which i guess is okay because they're supposed to be holy but then i kind of wish there was strings but so whatever i have one thing that i got from urban outfitters i got this on mega sale this was like five dollars um i think this one's also going to be really fun for when i go to new mexico and fun for going out um it is this really thick ribbed one shoulder top i've been loving the one shoulder recently i love the way that it looks i love this burnt orange color too because i don't really have anything this color I love how it's super super thick and ribbed so you don't have to wear a bra with it now, i probably wouldn't wear a bra with this anyway because i have no tits like <laughs> Like I really built like a jewel. I just think it's really fun and cute. And then I have this little t-shirt that I got from Anthropology, another random item. I went in there with my mom. I never usually shop there. This was on sale for like $25, which for Anthropology is really, really good. Loose comfy v-neck t-shirt, which I wear all the time, but it is this pretty maroon and white ombre, which is definitely different than stuff that I have. I have a lot of oversized comfy tees, but I don't have any in this color or like ombre. So um, just gonna be a good simple t-shirt for back to school. And then like throw on one of these cute chokers. Like you are good to go. I have one random thing from Nordstrom Rack this haul is getting so long you guys um but i saw this sweater i am a stripes 
fiend i'm obsessed with everything striped i have so many striped things and i saw this on sale and i am obsessed with the colors it's kind of overexposed so i don't know how well it's going to show up that it has like mint green and yellow and red and like all these super cute adorable colors really soft and comfy it's going to be a nice little sweater to have for the fall and winter time throw on with some jeans or just some leggings and i have two things from american eagle I haven't shopped there in a hot minute but they really do have cute stuff like we all need to stop sleeping on american eagle first thing i got is this tie-dye crew neck i brought this to the pacific northwest with me a fun little sweatshirt to have and i'm really excited to have this for back to school um it's in this blue and white tie-dye pattern it's a comfy sweatshirt which i have a lot of but um because it's tie-dye it's something really different for me super super comfortable really soft oversized cozy all those things that we love in a sweatshirt i found this t-shirt on sale like i said i'm obsessed with stripes this reminds me of an exact shirt i had like sophomore year of high school um it's just a black and white striped really oversized t-shirt you guys like this is legit an extra small i kind of wish i would have just gotten it in a medium and then had it as a t-shirt dress but whatever um i've already worn this a lot just because it's a really good basic to have for school and the last store that i have stuff from finally my mouth literally hurts from talking so a few things from marshall's again stop sleeping on marshall's i have found some of the cutest stuff and like amazing deals there the first thing that i got is this pink calvin klein t-shirt i actually found this in the little boys section for seven freaking dollars i saw a t-shirt just like this on princess polly a pink calvin klein t-shirt and it was like close to fifty dollars and this one was seven in the little boys section this is a large by the way i wore this um in seattle for a day in the city again it's just a good little t-shirt to have to throw on for school and class or whatever i love pink it's probably my favorite color and the next one marshall's oh my god i'm obsessed with these things you guys i know i talked about how much i love camo but leopard slash cheetah i don't know how to tell the difference has been my jam i have pretty much every single article of clothing in cheetah that you can have but you know what i didn't have is overalls <laughs> who am i buying overalls i just thought these were a really cute different item for me to have I'm always on with a white or black t-shirt and they're a really easy thing to throw on for class they're a really soft and comfy like sweatshirt material and they have pockets in the front and the back we love to see that it's a really easy outfit to throw on like for class or for school oh yeah that is everything in this ginormous back to school clothing haul i really hope that you guys liked it saw some cute threads for back to school be sure to subscribe to my channel if you are new and you haven't already follow me on instagram if you feel so inclined um again everything that i can find links for will be linked down below thank you guys so much for watching and sticking through this long butt video and i'll see you guys in my next one bye